In this video, we'll show you how to use Google Bard AI even if it's not available in your country. First, search for Google Bard and then open this Bard AI website. Here, as you can see it says Bard is not currently supported in your country. To bypass this, we'll be using the VPN connection. This is the Hotspot Shield VPN. Click on the power icon in middle to start. Now our IP address and location is changed to New York, USA. After refreshing the page once, you will notice that we've got access to the Google Bard Experimental AI. Here, we'll enter the prompt and get the response back from the Bard. Let's open the chat GPT in the next window to compare the performance and capabilities of both generative AI. Here, we have provided the same prompt to both Google Bard and chat GPT. You will notice that the response we got from Bard AI on right is almost instantaneous. On the other hand, ChatGPT is taking its time to provide the code. However, ChatGPT has provided every single step that you need to take to run the following script. It even guided where to click in order to create a Google Apps script project. And Google Bard only mentioned the name of variables that needs to be changed. As you scroll up a bit, you will find Google Bard has created three different for the same prompts. Each draft is different from the other in the way they function. We guess this happened because of a vague and unspecific prompt. Thanks for watching.